Hope you guys, um, today I'm going to be doing a video that I've actually made a hundred times. The Mass Effect 3 Collector's Edition Unboxing. I've made this so many times and I just never bothered to upload each and every single one. Just because I'm like that. So I'm hoping this is the final one. Uh, let's get right into it. Alright. Mm, I didn't even bother to check the lighting. So first off, you know, it's, it's like... It's like a regular Xbox disc case. It's fatter. Outside of these two things. This is the the tin case that carries the actual discs of Mass Effect 3. And you see on the front side it's got Mail Shepard and on the back it's got Fem Shep. Alright, let's see if I can open it. There we go. She's got both discs and I'm not sure of this but I think Mass Effect 3 for the PS3 only has one disc. The reason why it has two discs for the Xbox is because it can't hold as much like data on one disc. Um, you, if you look inside the thing, you get codes for your online pass so you can play multiplayer. And you get, oh, and then there's just a kingdom, a kingdom of Amalur. I can't pronounce it. If you play the demo, you get that armor and that gun, which actually, I think the gun is pretty cool. So is the armor. And then also you get a Avatar Award, the Normandy. And then if you play the game, you just should get uh, the Shepard's Helmet and the Omni Blade, which are both really cool. And then here is, you get two days of Xbox Live. It's already used. Everything on here is already used. And that's that. And you also get the Day 1 DLC, which is good. Alright. Now that we're done with the disc, we get to the actual Collector's Edition part. You see Shepard's pulling someone up on the front of it. Ah, uh, maybe it's Anderson, I don't know. So, let's see if I... I'm trying to do everything with my one hand, and it's extremely hard. First thing I'm going to pull out here, the art book. Uh, it's a little bit small, but it's still just... It's very insightful. It just says so much. Each and every bit of it, I love. Uh, small spoilers, maybe, if you go through this. Uh, there's one part that I especially love. Let me get to it. I don't know. It's, I might have passed it already. It's just reading. This is really cool. There's one part where it's got this thing with the elusive man being the main enemy. Like the main bad guy for it. Let me see if I can find the page. No. Ah, oh, where the hell is it? I really wanted to show you guys this. It's, it's crazy cool. Okay, maybe it's all in my mind. Mass section. As <laughs> I had in my one video. Alright. I'm not willing to take my time to go through that. Anyway, let's try and keep the video short. Then also inside here you get a little demo of the comic of the comic book. Mass Effect eva Invasion, which is basically Avaria Taloke, oops, trying to take back Omega from Cerberus and the Reapers, which, frankly, a lot of people have been saying that they want that to be DLC for Mass Effect 3, and I would actually love that very much. It'd be really interesting. Uh, it's just a little demo of the full comic book, though, which is a little disappointing. Third item, the lithograph of the Normandy. It's just a cool little thing to have. And then there is a fourth thing inside. But, uh, this is true. The day I got this entire package, I lost the N7 fabric patch that you can like, stick on your clothing. So you got the N7 thing on your shoulder. Which, frankly, is really cool. But I lost it. Like, seriously, like the first day I got it, I lost it immediately. Which sucks. And then I found it, and then I lost it again. So that blew. Thanks for watching the video, like, subscribe, do all that nice stuff, and I will see you later if I press the right button. Alright, I will see you later, goodbye.